What is up, everybody? I'm Christine Williamson here with Denzel Mims, former Baylor wide receiver. What's good, bro? How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Just chilling, you know, maintaining. Um, and I have five questions for you mm -hmm. uh, to see which one you would rather. I mean, it's a very simple game. Okay. Yeah. Number one, would you rather catch balls from Tom Brady or Peyton Manning? I'm going to go with Peyton. Really? Why is yeah. that? Peyton the GOAT GOAT. Like, he was the first original GOAT, you know. Uh -huh. So, But, you know, Tom do win Super Bowls. So, yeah. I'm going to still go with Peyton because when Peyton was on the game, I always played with Peyton Manning. So, I'm going to go okay. with Peyton Manning. Peyton yeah. Manning, the GOAT GOAT. Yeah. I like it. The OG. <laughs> would you rather be covered by Richard Sherman or Patrick Peterson? Oh, Richard Sherman all day. Why is that? You know, this is this going to be live? Is you going to post it somewhere? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. People are going to see this. <laughs> I mean, Pat P, you know, he, he good. You know, Pat P real good. You know, he, he probably one of uh -huh. the best corners in the league. And, um. But Richard Sherman, he's kind of got a little older, you know. You know, tall guys ain't really, really stiff in the hips. So, I mean, I feel like I can probably do whatever I want with Richard Sherman. Okay. Okay. You got to cut that out, though. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell nobody you said that. Yeah. <laughs> you already know how Richard Sherman is. He, he's not yeah, about that talk. That's what I'm saying. That's why I really want to You're like, uh, uh, uh. You're like, <laughs> okay. Uh, would you rather play at the next level with your former coach or some of your former teammates? I would probably say I would probably say my teammates, you know, because I mean yeah. I could bond with them outside off the field. You know, my coach mm -hmm. would be busy all the time, so we yeah. really hang out. And I can even if I'm not playing for them, I can still call them and yeah. talk to them. Yeah. So I really play That's for my, for my teammates. All right. Would you rather win a Super Bowl or win a regular season MVP award? Super Bowl. All day. All day. Why it is it that ever. easy? Why is it I that mean, easy? I mean, because I'm a team player. So, you know, I'd rather have a team thing. Like, I'd rather have, have a Super Bowl because that means the whole team put in, put in and y'all yeah. want it together. That makes Awards sense. will come I mean, sooner or later. Uh, the last one. Would you rather be overrated or underrated? Underrated. I've been underrated my whole life. Still am, so I'd rather be underrated. Yeah. For sure. Um, it's interesting that you say you've been underrated your whole life because you are in a draft class with like that's stacked mm -hmm. with receivers, right? Yeah. yeah. Where do you feel like you stack up in this list of receivers that are going into this draft? Top five. Top five for sure. Mm -hmm. I feel honestly feel like I'm the best in this in this draft class, but just to be fair, I'm gonna say top five for sure. You know, everyone supposed to think they're the best and the best no matter what. Yeah. But I'm gonna say top five for sure. What do you feel like you as a player offer to the NFL team that will draft you? Uh, I compete. You know, I'm tough. I'm not. I'm not a selfish guy. You know, I come to work every single day. Um, I play through injuries. Um, and I'm going to help you win. And I'm going to produce. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm going to bring to the table. You talk about playing through injuries. Wasn't your hand broken your junior year? Yeah. Would you need your hands to catch balls? How did you do that? Uh, you know, just, you know, just play through it. <laughs> you know, I played through it. I mean, it was broke. And it hurt, you know, but, you know, I try not to let it affect me. I want to be there for my team. And I knew that I could get surgery after the season like I did. And so I just got surgery after the season. Um, who's going to be with you when you get drafted? Um, my mom, my grandmother, my uh, agent, my uh, girlfriend, and my baby, my daughter. I was about to say, did you just have a baby? Wait, how old yeah, is she, she now? She's she 11 months. months. 11 months. Oh, my gosh, it's almost a year. She's yeah. the most precious thing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What do you, what do you feel like being a father? Since she's 11 months, she's almost a year. Mm -hmm. In this last almost year, what have you learned about being a father? 
I mean, I got you got to put your daughter first, you know, and you got to be there at all times, you know, because mm-hmm. they grew up fast and she grew up fast. And I mean, every day she, you know, she she develop a new personality. So yeah, I mean, I want to be there for every moment. So I mean, I love it. I love them. I love her to death. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube for live streaming sports and premium content. Subscribe to ESPN Plus.